Thank you, Mark. We love what's happening weather-wise outside right now. Here's a picture you're looking at over the city. Feels like a beautiful sunny day. Let's send it over to Bob. It's clear and it's warm, but it's dry out there. Humidity is really quite low, very comfortable. 86, but the humidity is only 33%. Those southwest breezes at 15 kept it nice, comfortable, even though it was really warm out there. 54 dew point, that's quite low. The barometer holding steady to 9.88 inches. 88 still up in Frederick right now. It's 72 at Ocean City. They've dropped a little bit. And also uh, down to 78 at Annapolis with a bit of a breeze off the bay. There's still 85 in D.C., 82 Bel Air. A couple of places are missing for some reason. I guarantee you, Westminster is still there, but their temperature is missing. Same thing with Cumberland and Oakland. They're just gone today. <laughs> it's, well, maybe they're just outside, maybe. 85 will play to 86 down in Patuxent. Yeah, very warm day. 88 this afternoon. Guess what? That's normal for the warmest week of the year here. July 9th to about the 15th, our normal high for the highest week all year is 88. That's what we hit this afternoon. This morning, 62. The uh, normals are 74, 52, and the records 96 and 41. Right now, shower activity, thunderstorms across much of northern Pennsylvania, New York State, a whole tier there along the New York Thruway. All the way towards Syracuse, up toward Albany. It's all moving off to the east, northeast. Some of this across Ohio may swing back toward our region late tonight, although a lot of it's going to break down. Right now, we have winds coming out of the west, southwest, 5, 10, 15, 20 miles an hour. So a nice, warm breeze. But this front about to the north. Eventually, we'll get through the region sometime overnight during the day tomorrow. It may bring a widely scattered shower, maybe some thunder tonight and in the morning. Maybe late in the day or tomorrow night, you might see some more activity. But I think much of tomorrow's afternoon is going to be pretty Decent. Take a quick look at the tropics. We do have Invest number 90. It may develop into a tropical system, which will be named Arthur. But look where it's going, way out in the Atlantic. Maybe impact in Bermuda in about four or five days, if it does, in fact, develop. For us, the frontal boundary crossing the region overnight tonight. Some cloud activity with it during the day tomorrow. At least the model showing generally clear to part of the cloud of skies. A shower mainly south of us. But during the week, we have another area of low pressure going to be approaching the region. More water scattered activity pretty much all the week long. We could see some pretty decent rainfall amounts by the time we get to next week. So tonight, part of the cloudy shower, a thunder shower is possible. 65 at the overnight tomorrow. Back up to 79. Yes, tad cooler with northeast winds and north northeast winds at 6 to 12. 71 on Sunday. Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, risk of showers every single day, but certainly much cooler for Tuesday and Wednesday. May not even get out of the 50s again on Tuesday and warm up for the end of next week with another chance of shower by next Friday. Back to you.